It's looking like a beautiful day in the city to meet new people and talk about fashion. This is what we're wearing today. It's 3.33. What are you wearing today? I'm wearing a Celine blazer, Suzy Condi cashmere sweater, Suzy Condi velour flares, and Celine shoes. Suzy Condi beanie, Celine bag. Wow. I love this blazer today. Thank you. Thanks very much. And you match the colors all together so perfectly. And my dogs as well. <laughs> Where do you get your style inspiration? Um, I guess my dogs today since I'm <laughs> matching the color. All over the place. Okay. Lots of different places, yeah. What do you do for a job? I'm a designer. Wow. Yeah. For who, if you don't Susie mind Condi. <laughs> I am Susie. What is the best piece of advice you've ever received? Don't take everything so seriously, especially in fashion. I love that's that. That's it. Yeah, for sure. So something I do is I give $2 bills to people with nice style. What? That's so nice. <laughs> Thank you nice very to meet you. much. Take See care. You later. Bye. What are you wearing today? Oh, I'm wearing um, this trench coat. It's from the Frankie shop. It's my favorite trench coat. Um, shirts from H&M. Jeans are seven for mankind, I think. And boots are Zara bag is Bottega. Oh sweet. I noticed your jacket. That's really nice. Thank you. And the way you put everything together today. Thanks. I was going for like a casual relaxed vibe. And it's nice today. So yeah right? It's, the sun's out. Yeah the sun's out. It's not too cold. And where do you get your style inspiration? Honestly it could just be like whatever mood I'm in or it could be just people walking on the street. They might have something on and I'll be like I'm trying that and see how I can put my spin on it. But yeah there's no one in particular where I can say is my inspiration. I'm a content creator, consultant, and model. Okay, wow. <laughs> you do it all. Do many things. <laughs> <laughs> what is the best piece of advice you've ever received? I would say the best piece of advice is probably from my dad, um, and that's to never give up, continue working, um, try to be strong, and there's always a better tomorrow. I love that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I've never seen these. Two dollar bills. Wow. What are you wearing today? It's all vintage. Wow. Yeah, thank you. It's a mostly from Williamsburg, Brooklyn. Uh, Monk. It's a really cool store to check out. Okay. Yeah. I love your outfit today. Thank you. Take care. Have a good one. Zoom, zoom. Early spring and fall, simply the most wonderful time of year for fashion in New York City. Great for layering pieces, mixing and matching and just experimenting overall. I am wearing old first as pretty much. Uh, it's a vintage 70s suede leather jacket. This one I thrifted it and the pants as well. And these are vintage as well. Uh, I work for a department store and I also have my own projects on the side as well. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, you put the colors together so perfect today. Thank you, really appreciate that. Where do you get your style inspiration from? Mostly from vintage, um, working with proportions, um, like different designers. I don't know if I derive my inspiration from current fashion more than previous. Not to say that there's, you cannot find inspiration in current <laughs> times, but I think you need to master the old in order to break the rules and reinvent the new. Well said. <laughs> Thank you. What is the best piece of advice you ever received? Ooh, that's a heavy one. Be authentic to who you are at the core. That comes with your core values, with your ethics, and that really will reflect in every decision you make in life, no matter what. So stay true to yourself. I agree. That's beautiful. Thank you. Oh, oh my god, this is awesome. Thank you know you. what? I am from Puerto Rico and someone over there gave me one. Oh wow. And I carry it with me as a like, good luck not spending this. This is great. Thank <laughs> you. What a great day. I love that sweatshirt. Ah, sweatshirt. Yeah. What are you wearing today? I'm wearing a Sadro suit from like a few years ago. Beauty Glow shirt. And some Air Forces, man. Okay. You can't forget the Rage bag. Oh, that's nice. Got all the compartments in there? Yeah, I got a whole bunch of shit in there. <laughs> yeah. All Saints hat, yep. I like how you kind of contrasted the, the pink. Yeah, with the, the blues. And the color of your hat too yeah. as well. Yeah, appreciate well it. Well done. Yeah, I take it serious. I take the I take the fashion serious. I'd like to get into like stylist work one day. I'm into you know. music and things like that too. So that's what ends up happening. Fall into all these different paths, but I broke it down to just expression. This is all about how you express yourself. You look good, you feel good. You know, you feel good, you look good. Those things, I, I think it works synergistically. It's about expression. Yeah, for sure. It's all about expression. Someone's wearing like 
all monotone. They're probably just trying to bring some simplicity into their life or things like that. So sometimes it's really about expression. It's not always about like, you know, how you carry yourself with uh, verbiage and things like that. It could just be with the outfit and that can start the conversation just like how we've been, you know? So That's yeah, up, I like that. Appreciate you, man. What's your name? I'm Johnny. John? Nice yeah. to meet you. I'm Kyle. So real quick, yeah. what do you do for a job? Oh, so I work in retail. Um, I try to make people just as fashionable as me and bring out that sense of expression within themselves. I, I like to get people to bring out their sense of style. I, I know this sense of expression is hidden between every individual out here. Individuality is a must, I believe. It's also what brings us together, you know? What is the best piece of advice you've ever received? One of my first jobs was in a supermarket as a cashier. And this guy came, he bought some items, and he said, every Kyle I met became a millionaire. And my name being Kyle, I was like, oh, that gave me just enough motivation just knowing like, okay, cool, maybe I need to be one of those Kyles on that list as well. Not so much advice, but it was just motivational, you know, more affirmational, you know, things like that. Yeah, sometimes it's like a little guardian angel comes out of nowhere and just yeah. puts something in your ear yeah. and you don't forget so, it. So, and then like once those talents arise or once people see those talents within you, it's probably a sign to take it more serious so you can get that, you yeah, know. It definitely yeah. like gave me a sense of like push and determination and it, I took it as advice to you know be one of those cows and maybe become a billionaire not just a millionaire you know yeah and so yeah. the advice could be to pay attention to your surroundings and kind of be, be open to what people say I guess yeah be open on that and then be present so you can um, add add on to it or subtract what you need to um, being present is very important so I guess that was that moment that advice would be like it made me focus on being present in the moment and capitalizing on every moment yeah. yeah, I love that. I, I think it clicks into just about what anyone's doing. So that's how we can all connect. Like I said, that individuality is what also keeps us all really connected. No doubt. It was right. great talking to you today. Appreciate it, man. Likewise, Johnny. Man, you're the man. I like that. I like that. I appreciate Take you, care, man. Johnny, have a great one. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, for sure. I love your style. I love your shoes. Oh, appreciate Thank it. you so much. Where do you get your style inspiration from? Um, honestly, my mom. I think she was a huge influence on me growing up. I think just everybody on the street in New York is so cool. This is the biggest city for fashion. You can find inspiration everywhere you look. I'm seeing a little bit of Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, I know. Here. I was wondering if my outfit was a little bit too piratey today. No, I'm intrigued. I haven't seen style like this. I love it. Thank you. I appreciate it. What do you do for a job? I'm a style and a personal shopper. Love okay. Shoppers. What is the best piece of advice you ever received? Just stay true to yourself because you are the only you. The outcome will be better if if you are yourself. Just be yourself. I love that. Oh my god! Thank you! <laughs> That's amazing. I've never had a two dollar bill. Oh wow. I will cherish it. I'm wearing a hat that I bartered from a very nice Chinese man on St. Mark's Place. A flannel that I got on eBay, Carhartt jacket that I got on eBay, Carhartt pants that I got on eBay, and these Runzu Chinese shoes that, believe it or not, let them guess where it's from. eBay. It's from eBay. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. eBay is the plug. This is my leather jacket from a thrift store. Home. Um, a Uniqlo scarf. Okay. And a thrifted top, I don't know. And these are his pants. They're very cool in the back. Oh, sweet. And also from eBay. Pants. Where do you guys get your style inspiration? Um, I 
like skate and stuff. So like a lot of my favorite skaters have like cool style. I don't really like think about fashion. It's just wear what I like and stuff. Yeah, that's what's up. That's me. Yeah, I'm living in New York. Everyone is very inspiring. Everyone on the street. I work at a steakhouse. Yeah, for sure. Catch steak. Pull up. <laughs> my mom gave me really good advice. She says, eat your rice. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah, and it's not like literally like eat your rice. It's like, you know, like you got to deal with like a lot of like punches in life. Sometimes you got to like not have the fancy meals and the steaks and eat out. Like sometimes you just got to eat your rice. You got to take everything like grain by grain and just like be able to deal with like the hardships and stuff. And um, yeah, it'll still keep you full. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So just dealing with like the bullshit, it'll... Uh, It'll all pay off eventually. That's really yeah. valuable advice. Eat your rice. Yeah. yeah. Honestly, I like that. Yeah. I think yeah, that's yeah. that's pretty good. Let's go with that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go with I'm that one. I'm gonna say eat your rice as well. Yeah. To eat your rice. Oh wow. Oh, wow. Dude, How lucky. thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'm so grateful to have met so many amazing people today, and really every week, I really just love meeting and talking to new people. That's what we believe, that people with passion can change the world for the better. What are you wearing today? I'm wearing ASOS, YSL, and Rick Owens. Nice color combination going on here. Thank you, I appreciate it. Got the blacks and the grays all <laughs> yes, perfect. Yes, exactly, the contrast, the silvers, you know. For sure. Oh, no. <laughs> Where do you get your style inspiration? Um, honestly, Pinterest. I'm a model, yeah. I'm wow. with genetics management out here. What is the best piece of advice you've ever received? Ooh, um, to be happy. Very happy. <laughs> Can't beat that. Yes. Oh, thank you. <laughs> That's so sweet. Take care. Amazing. What are you wearing today? Um, I forgot. I bought it in, in my country, in oh. Indonesia. What is the best piece of advice you've ever received? Just do whatever you want. Be happy. I love the green today. All right. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah. Take care. Thank you. Thank what are you wearing today? Hey, what's up? Um, got a black puffer on. True Religion Supreme. Far right pants. And CPSM on Air Force. Vintage hat. Love the all black fit today. Can't go wrong with all black fit. What do you do for a job? R for MTA. If the train's delayed, it's not my fault. <laughs> What is the best piece of advice you've ever received? Piece of advice? Um, you only live once, live life to the fullest. Nothing lasts forever. Just keep going. Whatever you want to do, just do it. Yeah, I love that. Thank you. <laughs> Appreciate it. Take care. I want to make sure to keep things fresh and exciting for you guys. We got some new things in the works. Make sure to stay tuned on the next episode. What are you wearing today? Uh, my check is acne, Zara, Docs. Perfect sweatshirt. jacket today. <laughs> Thank you. It's very washed. It wasn't like this before. It's a cool look. Thank you. <laughs> Where do you get your style inspiration? Uh, New York, really. Mm -hmm. No Just place other. So, for sure. Yeah. What do you do for a job? Uh, I work in production. What is the best piece of advice you've ever received? Live for yourself and not others. Oh, wow. Yeah. I love that. Oh, thank you. That's awesome. You take care. Thank you. You too. What are you wearing today? Oh, this is a Polish coat. It's a new edition. This is a Dali painting, a Dali rose. And what about the shoes? Where are they from? I got these online. I think they're Stacy Adams. Where do you get your style inspiration? Comfortable. Classic. Yeah, that's very classic. Yeah. What do you do for a job? I work in theater. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. Music. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. No joke. <laughs> yeah, Jefferson. <laughs> I remember these. Great to see you. I love this jacket Likewise. today. Thank you. Uh, American Trench. Oh, I like the little detail on the inside, the camo. Uh, they're American uh, manufacturer for uh, outdoor.
outerwear. They do like bomber jackets, leather jackets, and trenches are all made in uh, the U.S. And you got classic jewelry as well. Of course, you know, my brand, Echo Collections, and what have you. So my stuff, Can't necklace as well. Yep. Good to see you today, brother. Good to see you again, too, man. What are you wearing today? Um, my skirt's from The Source Unknown. My sweater is actually from my roommate's closet. Uh, the jacket's from Naked. My shoes are Docs. Okay. And then I got this from like a random place in the, um, the textile district. It's like a random store. It looks comfy. Yeah. <laughs> it's a chill fit overall today. Thank you. Where do you get your style inspiration? usually just start with like a piece and like work from there you like choose a piece that like you're like really into mm -hmm. and work from there like what is the best piece of advice you've ever received friend kindness i'm all about that <laughs> thank you yeah take Have care a good one. you too how you doing great to see you and i love the jacket today thank you very much it's a nice cool day perfect for this perfect stars for the starling thank you thank you start exactly starling welcome to on this video visit to New York City. I have a, another star jacket. I'll have to wear that sometime for you. It's like a sheen outfit. Uh, bag is from House of One. And like my shoes, it's from Zara. Like it's boots, so it's from Zara. Yeah. Love the colors today. Thank you. And my sunglasses, it's from Aldo. Oh, sweet. Thank you. Where do you get your style inspiration? <laughs> So it's like uh, like I'm a fashion travel blogger. Okay. So yeah, if you like, you can follow me at Rupsi underscore Bansal on Instagram. What is the best piece of advice you've ever received? Ignore what people say about you. Just accept positive vibes. Oh, I love that. that. Yeah, that's what all you need. Yeah. It really is. Yeah. <laughs> oh. And we believe that in this world, people can change it for the better. That was a good one. That was a good one. Just grabbed a slice from Champion Pizza. First and foremost, it's a greasy one. So we've been to Champion Pizza before, but first time having the pepperoni. I don't know, it's not bad, but it's not my favorite pepperoni slice. Good crust, good cheese, solid overall. I'm gonna rate this out of five Ralphs. Ralph is named my dog. 4.2 Ralphs. What are you wearing today? I'm wearing Marnie, Dries Von Noten, and Lon this jacket today. Thank you. A little detail. Marnie piece. All over. Little fuzzies and uh, little flowers everywhere. Where do you get your style inspiration? Colors, uh, atmosphere, shapes. It just it just depends. Fashion director for Bloomingdale, so I work in fashion. What's the best piece of advice you ever received? Uh, just be yourself. People are gonna love it or hate it, but just be yourself. No doubt. <laughs> hey, take you. care, man. Have a good one. What are you wearing today? Um, I'm wearing a Wilfred Picot. We love this. Pandas. Basic leggings. Nothing crazy about these. Um, unique little turtleneck. I just crop it. Like, I fold it under. I got this hat because I love cows and I thought it was so cute. Um, Tell Feezy right here. I'm running to a meeting, so I just have some books in here. And then I'm a huge jewelry girl. Oh, let me check that. Okay, so this is like what we got going on. So this is from the M Jewel. This is Gucci. This is, I'm not really sure. This, my mom made it in Iran. This is from the M Jewel, Cartier. I love this designer. You can get it from Wolf and Badger and they have match earrings, but I love this ring so much. Anything drippy, they sell right across the street. That's really unique. <laughs> I need a great mix of jewelry here. Thank you, and I have this. I wear this one every day. It's my name in Farsi, because I'm Persian. Where do you get your style inspiration? I don't know. I kind of like to make a mixture of things I just like myself. And I always just wear black, maybe a pop of color here and there. And probably just on Instagram, I see a lot of girls saying like gorgeous. And if I like something they do, I kind of try to take a little bit in from them and then mix it with what I usually wear. Yeah, and you got a great mix of black and white. Yeah, always about the contrast. And what do you do for a job? I'm a designer salesman. Oh, sweet. Yeah, so that's it. Best 
piece of advice I've received, probably, I think it's, my dad gives great advice and he always just says, life's a game, do whatever makes you happy and to live every day like it could be your last. So it's honestly what I do. That's a good outlook, I love that. Oh my God, thank you, are you sure? I am sure, thank just you. don't so spend it. It's lucky, no, 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 I'm not gonna spend it. Thank you so much. <laughs> sure. no, I really That's a wrap. I love you so much. And I'll see you next time. Peace. Eat your rice. You know what I'm saying?